so this time I'm here with my move out vlog. So I am moving out of Glenmore because I'm going to be moving into a different building at Glenmore next school year. So how it works is that typically you could just renew your lease and just like stay here, you like leave your stuff over the summer and like you don't have to move out at all. You can just come back, continue living in your same space. But because I chose to live in an LLC, which everyone here is second years, obviously I won't be a second year next year, so that's why we were forced to move out of this building. <clears throat> so I had to select a different contract. And that's why I will be moving out this summer. So be taking you guys along to show like the move out process. So I just finished my first final. One down, getting closer to finishing. My PA made us little like finals week, like a little care package. It's so cute. But I do need to get started on moving out. I I should be doing that because I'm moving out this Friday. So first thing I'm gonna do is start cleaning up everything before I like pack. And now I'm wiping down my shoes and my scooter so that they're clean for me to pack away. Of course, we gotta sanitize my desk too. Closing the tabs for the finals that I finished studying for it's so satisfying. <laughs> Anyways, the first thing I think I'm going to start on is packing my clothes. Basically, when it comes down to, like, the last week, I will literally wear the same outfit the whole week just so I can pack everything up. And, like, the clothes are already dirty, I'll just keep wearing. <laughs> so at least I can get started on packing. I think I'm going to pack away all of these school supplies first because I'm not going to really need to use them. So I'm going to put everything into this pouch. I changed because it got too hot. I'm gonna put my luggage down so I can fill it with clothes. obtained quite a few tote bags so I'm just gonna put them on the top layer here since they're thin and will fit anyways. I used up the rest of my dying dollars for the quarter and a gift card to get this. <clears throat> so I'm gonna eat and then we're gonna go back to studying for finals and then at night I'm going to continue packing up. I went to the library to work on my final project and to study for my final. This is going to be my last cooked meal because I used up all my ingredients. So I've really been saving it for when I'm starving. And I'm currently starving because I have been at the library for so long <laughs> studying. I'm trying to finish eating everything in my food drawer so that I don't have to like bring anything home. I'm getting there. It's pretty empty. Hello, so today I 
literally planned out my meals. Exactly. I'm be eating this. I just finished my last final. I only have a project left. And I got the barn for dinner. I got chicken sandwich and fries. I'm gonna eat. I finally finished my marketing plan. Oh my god, that took me so long. I will not disclose what time it is, but it's very late that it's early. Good morning, guys. So while I'm still in my pajamas, I'm gonna start taking the things off my wall. It's kind of sad because I have all my pictures and it's so cute. I took off all my lights and I didn't keep the original boxes of these, so I'm just gonna put them back. And I took everything else off my wall after lunch. I just took down everything from my walls. It's kind of sad how empty it is. Okay, I'm gonna clear the rest of my desk now. <laughs> Basically, I've been literally like running out of everything. This is my air purifier because I'm like cleaning. So all the dust is coming up. Anyways, so oh dang, I didn't realize this. Basically, I've been like struggling a lot these last few weeks. I've been like literally running out of everything. I'm like out of tissue paper, I'm out of toilet paper, I'm out of paper towels, I'm out of cotton pads. I'm like struggling. <laughs> and then I'm also running out of food. Like I ran out of like ingredients for me to cook. And then I also ran out of my meals, so I just go to the dining hall. But I also ran out of like dining donuts <laughs> to like buy food to eat. So really, I've been planning it out exactly that it would last me enough. So for lunch, I use my last meal slice, <laughs> and I'm completely out of everything else. <laughs> I've been panicking so badly because I couldn't find things. <laughs> I finally found them and the room is a mess because after I'm like packing everything, I don't know where to put things. So they're just sitting there. I'm gonna try to fit all this into my backpack right now. <laughs> okay, so I am making quite some progress. I have packed my bag as much as I could and then over here is a pile of all the boxes that need to go into that luggage and then it's also all my electronics that I need to pack away.
think I'm doing decent. It's just really dusty and it's like making me really itchy. I've made a lot of progress. Now time to add my socks to my luggage. I'm just kind of worried for like the dirty clothes. Because I don't think it's going to fit in this. My stuff is cleared from all the cabinets. I checked the fridge, I checked the cabinets. The only things I need to check is my cleaning supplies. Yeah. See, my roommate already moved out. My room is a mess. <laughs> and then. I put all the stuff in here for now because I'm organizing the cabinets later. I need to clean the bathroom later too, like scrub it. Kept like my receipts from the beginning of the year so I know like what is mine to like take back. Afterwards, I'm gonna like deep clean and like wipe down the counters and everything, like the bathtub. Oh, yeah. dad just left and I'm starting to put my dishes away and just now my dad and I put my scooter back into the box it came in and we also put like other stuff in the cups. So a lot of stacking is going on here. I put the pan and then my pot and then my container inside my pot and there's stuff inside the container too and then my bowl and then cups and my favorite seasoning. So these bags are labeled. I put all my cleaning products and like the products in the Ziploc bag I had earlier in there. All my shoes are in there. My whole closet is cleared out. Now I'm gonna work on the dirty pile of clothes. I'm gonna sit on my cushion. I feel so proud right now. I managed to make all the clothes fit.
I just finished packing this drawer. And I also finished this one. On to the last one. I bubble wrapped the two the plates. There's so much hair on the floor. I need to like clean this floor after I'm done. I ended up putting my plates in here. Hopefully there's enough bubble wrap. I have finished packing all the drawers and now it's time to clean the whole apartment because I definitely do not want to be charged for any expenses. So in the beginning of the year you fill out a form that's like the conditions of your apartment and then at the end they'll like compare and if they see any damages done to like the apartment then you will be charged. So, that's why we definitely have to clean up after ourselves. Good night. It's moon out day. I'm gonna go throw away all the trash I have. Time is time to throw away all these boxes. I'm gonna go drop all these batteries and I'm gonna get the blue cart and my move out envelope. I'm gonna bring my driver's license to check out a blue cart because I don't wanna leave my ID card, otherwise, I can't get back in. Go down. Going down. So we taped up our bins so they wouldn't move in the cart. And then we put everything into the blue cart. And so far this is everything that we have. Here's our first trip of everything. I'm stuck. our first round of things. The bathroom is cleared. And I threw away the rug that was here because it was from Daiso, so it was really cheap and it would not last me another year. Goodbye. My dad just went to go throw out the last of our trash and then I'm going to bring this last cart down. So I put my keys in here and then I turn this in at the office. 